Now you should receive about four charts with your hand reading. And if you'll find the chart that says uh, hand analysis chart, we're going to, it's got the big hand on it. We're going to basically work off that. Then we'll bring the other charts in as we need them. So first thing you need to know is the left hand is the past. The right hand is the present and the future. It does not matter what handed you are. The left is the past, right is the present. Most of the work we do is on the present hand. Now, now the length of the fingers is, the ta is your talents. Long fingers mean one thing, short th fingers mean another thing. Nothing's good or bad, that's just the way you're born. Look down there in the lower right hand corner of your chart where it says palm shapes. The palm shapes are probably your most important talent. Oh, you got an artistic palm. <clears throat> That's nice. That's kind of a rounded palm. Rounded on the edge. That means you see color and proportion things that fit together well. Okay, go to the upper right hand corner of your chart. This is your type of fingertips. This is just the tips of the fingers. That's your personality. Oh my, you got two spatulates. That's your little actor actress fingers. <laughs> Intense, dramatic, energetic, adventuresome, actor, actress fingers. Uh, they're kind of, they're a little bit wider on the top than they are on the finger part. And then three round, intuitive, quick, very compassionate. Should be in the health field. I usually see those on the doctors and the nurses and the social workers. Okay, jump back down there to the thumb now. Gonna do your talents according to the length of your fingers. That thumb's quite long. Oh, that thumb's quite really long. Means you will do well in life. Good manual dexterity. Uh, you hold tools and instruments well with your hands. You work well with your hands. Okay, oh, that Jupiter finger, that index finger. Let me explain the names on these. Palmistry is two or three thousand years old. And, uh, they, they, they had, they'd go through and they'd name um, all of the fingers and then different areas of the palms and generally they were names of Greek goddesses or, or gods or astrological names and uh, so that index finger is the Jupiter finger the middle finger is the Saturn finger the ring finger is the Sun sometimes called the Apollo finger and the little finger is the Mercury finger then that section right between the heart line and the head line that clear across the palm that's called the Mars area and one more important one in the palm is right below the thumb that that little fat pad right at the base of the thumb that is called the Mount of Venus Venus goddess of love because that tells you about your sexual libido oh by the way that also is going to tell you if you're drinking enough water and you're very dehydrated there at the base of that thumb. Need to drink more water, 32 ounces a day. You want to see a nice little fat pad, of fat in there that you can't even hardly pick up the skin. And that, and that area right where it says six cents under the Jupiter finger, that's a little bit dehydrated too. You want to see a nice little fat pad right there. Okay, we are on the Jupiter finger, the index finger. Uh, that's oh that's nice and long that's excellent it was a really long finger that's the boss finger the manager <laughs> the uh, teaching finger sales finger your middle finger is very good too that's that's excellent good business sense when you've got that long middle finger that needs to be about the length of your palm when you got that good long uh, middle finger you know how to do business you know how to make money the ring finger, the sun finger, little tiny bit short, you're very practical, systematic, very organized, a place for everything and everything in its place. Uh, and the little finger is a little bit short too, that mercury. Hands-on person, you've got to be active, sitting at a desk is not your favorite thing to do. Well, let me see what you do for a living. Oh, you're a caregiver, oh boy are you active. <laughs> That's not an easy job, my dear.